Hey, welcome to homecoming. It's Motel Granite the Great Morehouse. The high school recruits, transfers through the portal, things like that. So this is a big business, positive thing down here at Morehouse College and down in the heart of Atlanta, Georgia. Both y'all gotta take a minute to tell me whatever. Anything that y'all got going that people will want to know about. You just said it one more time. Anything that y'all fans want to know about, because I got a following. So so explain whatever you want to say, and y'all going to be on my channel. You said anything that we got going on for us, so basically. Like, oh, I'm a barber. Barber. City. I be there all day in the future cuts. Follow me on Instagram, Don Cutem, D-O-N-K-U-T-T-E-M. I'm gonna get you right every time, no cap. Stay like that. You need Got you. Jordan been in here. I'll restore shoes. Give me your Instagram at Huncho underscore restoration. I'll restore J's, Nikes, anything you can think of. I'll ice them, get them clean, almost brand new. I'm the shoe dentist. Hit me up. What do you say? Geeking on bringing all kind of narcotics with me. Got guns on the table, I'm like, who's by the city? The head coach from the University of Life. Come to Morehouse and try to change things, and he will take some time, but he's going to. Great man. As Coach Copeland, I had an opportunity to work with him a couple years ago. I appreciate the opportunity. Things are getting bigger and growing on my side, but I'm so appreciative and thankful. This is the man that gave me an opportunity. So I'm thankful. Thank you, God, for the opportunity. There go Taylor, stretching it out. Free safety, magnificent young man, stretching it out. and it was doing pretty good. The passing game for Morehouse was struggling quite a bit. 
and Kentucky State has been a beneficiary of uh, some excellent field position. Morehouse actually has two forced turnovers. One of them, I believe, was converted into a touchdown from the very beginning. But other than that, it's just been a somewhat of a stalemate. And get ready to enjoy the halftime show. All right, love y'all. Something happened during the halftime show. They were supposed to announce the homecoming queen and different things like that, and they read the wrong names, the names of the people from last year. Um, this is embarrassing. They got family members who come in to support their young ladies in this spectacle of, uh, if this is a, a, an elaborate moment, this is like getting married, that type of a ceremony and celebration somebody did something wrong and I feel for them you know God bless these young ladies their families who travel from Virginia travel from DC and all over to see their young ladies names called so they can walk out on the middle of the field it's unfortunate but we're going to try to look at the positive end in some kind of a way thank you God I pray for their traveling safety to and fro thank you Oh. 